reports are surfacing of the death of a Gambian teenager in Kubajaju of Gifanga, who was allegedly shot and killed by Senegalese soldiers at the border village of uh, Jibijar on Sunday while out with colleagues to collect firewood. Now, the spokesman of the Gambia Armed Forces, when, contact, when contacted to set light on the issue, told iAfrica TV that a military patrol team has been sent to the scene from Kanilai to gather information on the incident. Mafuji says it takes a look at this latest shooting incident and a latany of orders on Gambian blamed on Senegalese security forces. Here's more of that in this report. This is Yakuba Jaju, allegedly shot and killed on Sunday by Senegalese soldiers in Jibijor, a border village in the Kasamas. Yankuba and his colleagues were said to have gone to the forest to collect firewood, just as people in that border area have done for as long as anyone can remember. According to an eyewitness account, once the lads were in the forest, they scattered, but then all of a sudden, they sighted a drone and then the sound of a gunfire. The death of Yakuba Jaju, if confirmed to have been the work of Senegalese soldiers, will likely spark new calls by Gambians for their immediate withdrawal. They have been implicated in several killings and human rights abuses since their deployment into the country in 2017. First, it was Haruna Jata who got shot and killed by Senegalese soldiers in Kanilai. Way back in 2017, in 2021, one Omar Njai of Sare Omar village in the URR was shot in the leg by Senegalese forestry officers who presently crossed into the Gambian territory on motorcycles. There is also the audacious shooting of Suleiman Trawale of Kantora by Senegalese security forces on the allegations of endangering wildlife. He was subsequently taken over to Senegal and was only repatriated after a strong stance taken by Nam for Kantora, Bileji Tunkara, for his release. It has become the norm in recent years for Senegalese security personnel deployed here in the Gambia to use brute force against Gambian civilians, especially on natives of Fonyi. Crossing the border in pursuit of illegal loggers is also becoming a pastime for Senegalese forestry officials. The sense of impunity they exhibit on Gambian soil is despicable and there is need to put a stop to this. Mafuji Sise, I African News.